Today is World Water Day and the first day of the UN 2023 Water Conference. A meeting like this hasn't been held in nearly 50 years and it comes as clean water concerns continue to rise. Here's ABC's Ginger Z. A new report released by the UN warning of a potential global water crisis. If we don't deal with it properly, then soon we are headed towards what would be a perfect storm and a truly global water crisis. The goal isn't hard to get behind, clean water and sanitation for all, but our planet is way off track. Two billion people worldwide don't have access to clean drinking water, according to that report. An additional 4.6 billion lack access to safely managed sanitation. Richard Connor, the report's author, says that water use has been increasing globally by about 1% per year over the last 40 years, and they expect it to keep going at a similar rate through 2050. The number one bottom line for increased water use is population growth. So you've got this increasing demand for water in these rapidly growing cities, but the water is finite. There's only a certain amount of it available. And with climate change, it's getting increasingly difficult to actually uh, predict how much water you will have from one season to another. The UN 2023 Water Conference is meeting to set goals and develop plans to improve these conditions. The solution? Connor says it comes down to political will. And when it comes to politicians, money matters. You can't have economic growth without proper water management systems. The report emphasizing that global cooperation is needed. This affects real people, real jobs. And this is not just something that you will see in developing countries. You'll see it right here in the U.S. For ABC News, I'm Ginger Z.